are interested in Buddhist meditation, you should know that they all consist of two steps. Everyone has two steps. There is the question of focusing on what we want and then accomplishing what we want. These are always the two steps. And one can work here with different kinds of power. If one just works on calming and holding the mind and so on, this gives some benefit, activates some of mind's potential. If we move on from there into compassion and wisdom, you know, I mean, really wishing to see and wishing to be useful to others, we press a lot more buttons and a lot more results come out. But if we work with the real powers of mind, the place where energy and awareness comes together, if we work with the energy lines in the body, if we work with the different syllables and vibrations of different centers in the body, then we get real results. And the strength of Diamond Way Buddhism is actually that the 16th Kamapa uh, gave my wife and myself uh, the job of making them in such a way that they keeping the essence but giving them such a slant that they could be used by people in the West in an easy, direct way. And I'll give you an example of this right now. You just relax, don't judge yourself, don't think I should meditate like this or like that, just enjoy. And now you think that you want to fully develop your mind so you can benefit all beings. And now in front of you appears the golden, transparent body of a Buddha, as perfect and beautiful as you can imagine. You understand that he shows the potential of mind, all the qualities that we have inside, and you want to receive that blessing. So now Buddha smiles, he comes closer to you to a pleasant distance, and now from the place between his eyebrows, from the center of his forehead, an intense crystal clear light shines out. It strikes the same place in your forehead. Now it shines into your brain and it fills your head now with radiant crystal clear light. And now all problems in your nerve senses and brain fall away. And you feel your body filling up with health. The body becomes a conscious tool to give others protection, love, and all the good things that they need. Now from his throat, a red light shines out. It radiates from his throat into your mouth and throat. It fills your speech center with radiant red light. Now all problems of your speech disappear. All disturbances, everything confused, ever said, goes away. And your speech becomes compassion and wisdom. You become able to guide and help beings. And you stay with this red light filling your mouth and throat. And now from the center of Buddha's chest, at the level of his heart, but in the center of the chest, a powerful deep blue light shines out. Deep blue and transparent. It shines into the same place of your chest and fills the center of your ribcage with deep blue radiant light. So the power of the blue light, now everything disturbed in your mind disappears. Mixed feelings, stiff ideas dissolve. And your mind becomes compassion and wisdom. Becomes a tool to benefit others. And now the Buddha in front of you dissolves into rainbow light and is now everywhere. He promises to take care of you, to help you wherever it's possible, to really be your friend and your protector. And he's now space everywhere around you, taking care of you and helping you in every way. You now think that you will use this good energy you received to benefit all beings, to give them a similar experience whenever you can. <laughs>